Greetings Poofarians, welcome back to our 100% completion playthrough of Day of the Tentacle. We are now at the attic in um, Ned and Jed's room. The kids from the professor, not Fred. I'm not sure if we actually got his name, the inventor down here, but we are here now. And uh, let's take a little a look around. Very Spartan. I, I, indeed, it is very Spartan. Very Spartan. We got some red paint there. All right, paint. Awesome. Got a window. I can see the roof right outside. You don't say. There's a cat here playing with a mouse. What a pretty pussy cat. Nice. Anything else? Let's use this pet. Um, can we also use this bed? So that's hard. So now we got a squeaky, squeaky mattress, and we're gonna use that on Jet's bed. Sounds like the cat's caught a moose up there. <laughs> uh, use this squeaky mattress then. Uh, come on, come on, come on, controller. So uh, let us now look at the mouse. We can probably cats pick it up. Dig these. Yeah, pick it up. Alrighty then. So we got the mouse. Pretty awesome, and we also want this paint. Uh, are we carrying it now? Yes, we are, and we're going to use the Boo Boo Be Gone with the red paint. Oh, I don't like pink. He doesn't like pink, and that's another trophy missing pink. That's why we had to do that. Uh, we are leaving through the window. Meanwhilst, soon all the power of the heavens will be mine. Oh, yeah. mine! That's if only we had some nasty weather. That's Benjamin Franklin, who looks a lot like that salesperson, by the way. Uh, we are. There's another pulley here. It's one of those pulley things. It's one of those pulley things. It's blocked up with somebody's bed. Ah, so in the in the present, this one is blocked and that one is open and now it's the other way around. We are going to use the chimney to get back down in the lobby. Or the main hall. Uh, but we're going to the lobby using the door. Even outside. Okay. So. Uh, come on, we are now moving... We need to go to the uh, outhouses. Can we get there? Uh, where are you? There you are. And there is a tree here. Uh, it's a kumquat tree. Mmm, kumquats. And we're going to use the red paint on the kumquat tree. And that's another trophy. One hoagie can make a tree. Awesome. So we now got red kumquats. It also looks like a cherry tree. And that's the reason why we had to paint it. Okay. So we are done with the red paint, uh, but Bernard isn't. And we will return to the main hall again. I don't want to go to my inventory. Thank you very much, game. I want to go to the path. And back inside. Like really inside. Like inside inside. <laughs> and back to the main hall. There you go. Because we need to talk to our good friend, um, Mr. Washington, right over here. That's a constitution in progress, by the way. You know what? Let's take a little look at it. Whoa, it's filling up fast. It is. Uh, Mr. Washington? He looks oddly familiar. Probably, uh, you're, you're 
probably recognize him from a banknote or something. Uh, excuse me. Yes. Hello, sir. Whoa, you're like George Washington. Whoa, you're like George Washington. Very much like him, according to my wife, Mrs. Washington. Oh, my name's Hoagie. My name's Hoagie. Like the sandwich? How quaint. Like the sandwich, indeed. Um, is it true about you and the cherry tree? Is it true about you and the cherry tree? Oh yes, it's quite true. Why, I've cut down acres of cherry trees in my day. I bet you've lost it. You couldn't cut down a tree to save your grandmother. I bet you've lost it. You couldn't cut down a tree to save your grandmother. Lost it, have I? Why, I'd show you a thing or two if there were a cherry tree nearby. But as you can see, there... Oh, well, what do you know? There is a cherry tree out there. Well, let's go chop the sucker down. I said come down from there at once! Try to understand. I'm stuck in this... Voila! You're quite a man. Yes, I know. And that gave us another trophy. Only George can destroy a tree. And now we have uh, access to Laverne. How awesome is that? Thank you, Hoagie. Uh, we are returning to the main hall. And right after we have done that, we are actually going to see what Laverne is up to. Because we haven't, uh, haven't done anything with her yet. Ta-da. Get me out of here. I haven't done anything. Well, you must have done something or you wouldn't be here now, would you? You'd be out in the lobby with your tentacle owner getting dressed up for the human show. Owner? No one owns me. Gosh, no owner, you say? Well, don't worry about it. I'm sure someone will come adopt you before we have to put you to sleep. Damn that, Dr. Fred. Indeed. Hey, she knows the Edison family motto. <laughs> so there's an old man here uh, who looks I a lot like Fred. I just want to pat his little head. Aww. Go ahead, make my day. And that guy looks like the son. I think they're both cheating. They're both cheating. Uh, I woman? think they're both cheating. Probably Mark. Yeah, probably. Uh, what else is there? So that didn't work. Looks bored. Mr. Tentacle Yoo -hoo, Guy? Mr. Tentacle Guy? What? Um, I don't feel so good. Ooh, I don't feel so good. I think I'm going to <laughs> throw up all over. Uh-oh. Time to visit Dr. Tentacle. Well, well, what have we here? I feel pukey. Indeed. All right, now hold still. Are you gonna use your scalpel? No, of course not. Darn. Do you want to use mine? Uh, no. Hmm. What? Hmm. What? What? Just as I suspected. What? There's nothing wrong with you, human. What a letdown. Well, I'm late for the show. I'll send your keeper back for you. Oh. Sit. Stay. Good boy. Alright. That was weird. I still don't 
don't understand how they can eat through a sucker. Nope. No, nobody understands. I want that. I want the chart. Um, can we go out? We can go out. Okay. This is weird. Don't want to be here yet. Hey, how'd you get out? Get back in there. Okay. I wish Dr. Tentacle would stop losing patience. Okay. Uh, Mr. Tentacle. Who, Mr. Tentacle Guy. Exactly, Mr. What? Tentacle Guy. I have to go to the bathroom. I have to go to the bathroom. Ha, that's a good one. Imagine a human using a bathroom. Come on, let's take a walk. Okay, human, do your business. Okay, I'm, I'm going to the right here. To the path. And I am going to give my scalpel to Bernard. We were actually carrying a scalpel. That was pretty, pretty neat. Uh, the tentacle chart goes to Hoagie. Because we are going to uh, do something uh, pretty amazing with that. And we are moving towards the second floor with Hoagie. So, is this the second floor? I told you guys I'll get to the flag next. I'm working as fast as I can. Oh. Hey, chill. Take your time. Don't tell me you've got another design change for the flag. I've got another design I've change for the flag. I've got another design change for the flag. I knew it. What's the current brainstorm from our fickle founding fathers? Whoa, could I could it have a chrome plated bald eagle robot on it? How about a skull with like scorpions in its mouth? Should have a hologram on somewhere. Uh, we need a babe in a leather bikini swinging a broad axe. Yes. We need a babe in a leather bikini swinging a broad axe. Oh, what the heck. At this point, I'd do anything just to have it over with. Put the pattern on the table and I'll look at it when I'm done with this job. Okay, first I'm gonna look around Amer uh, American flag prototypes. I like these. Too late, you've already rejected those. Uh. Stars and stripes, dull, yep. dull, dull. Hey, don't criticize unless you got a better idea. I actually do. Looks comfortable. That'd make a killer t-shirt. Huh. <laughs> it probably is a t-shirt already. My grandma had one like that. So who's who's Betsy she Ross? She looks busy. Shall we talk to her? The guys downstairs say they want a big family crest, and in the four corners they want a keg, some babes, a guitar, and some drumsticks. And underneath it all put America rocks. Just put the plans on the table and I'll get to it. Okay, 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 okay. I got some plans. Um what about these? The tentacle chart. That would make an amazing flag. <laughs> and that earns us another trophy. Windsock it to me. Sweet. All right, so we have a can opener that we want to give to a Laverne. We also have some spaghetti that we want to give to a Laverne. Then we have some dentures that we want to give to a Laverne. A squeaky mouse we want to give to Laverne. And. We want to give the booby gone to Bernard. And we're gonna f continue playing with Bernard. And we are going to continue with the game with Bernard next time. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget and feel free to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more 
awesome point and click adventure games. Tell your parents about me and leave a thumbs up and I hope to see you down in the comments. For now, I, Buffet, salute you.